Hey guys, I've missed you so, so much and uh, I'm sorry I disappeared for such a long time. I just don't really have much time for the videos right now and I'm not gonna go in detail with my explanation why I haven't been in videos. But I, um, I congratulate you with the new year and uh, Christmas and uh, I wish you all, all the best. I wish that um, all of your dreams come true and today I will be showing you how to make this design on your nails. Actually, I really like it. I don't know how to call it, but I really really like it. It has five rhinestones on each nail. So maybe it's uh, maybe it will be more suitable for some special occasion, but anyways, if you don't have rhinestones, you can just uh, use drops of red nail polish or red glitter on your nails. But I had this red rhinestones and I thought, why not use them? Yeah, so uh, that's it and um, I hope you will like the design. Uh, I hope you will leave some um, comments. And uh, in my next video, which I have already filmed, so I will upload it for sure, I will review this product by Lush. Critical butter, which is called Lemony Flutter. Yeah, so if you're interested, stay tuned. Okay, enjoy the tutorial. Baby, can you listen to me? I wrote this to you, this time I'll be true. You know I can live without you here. She's not in my world, not ever again Will I be the one that's not your friend? Alright, so the first thing you do, of course, is applying the base coat on your nails. I already have it on, as you can see, my nails are shiny. Then, uh, you would apply um, one or two coats of your base color. Mine is this very nice um, pinky light purpley color. Um, it is matte and it is quite um, pigmented. So I'm gonna apply just one coat of it. But uh, you can apply two coats to have more even and um, more pigmented color. Okay. So just don't don't rush, do your nails slowly. Because it's very very easy to mess up if you're in a hurry. After you applied your base color, let it dry completely. We need a very, very dry nails for the next step. Right, so when your um, base color is completely, completely dry, take your nail paint. Uh, I'm using white matte, matte color. So this is basically nail polish with this a thick brush. Um, you can also use just a regular nail polish with a very fine paint or liner brush. And what you do, very simple. At first you draw two diagonal lines which are crossing like so very simple and um, to make it uh, to make it more easy you just like twist your brush and your nails for um, for the for the position in which you are more comfortable doing the lines 
and then we are gonna cross these lines with smaller ones here on the sides like so and the second one and these small lines are gonna meet right here you will see uh, more details on the pictures and here on the bottom as well the same manner see and to decorate my nails even more while the nail paint is still wet I am taking the tooth uh, pick and the red rhinestones and I'm applying them wherever my lines cross see just catching the rhinestones with a tooth stick and sticking them in the places where the lines cross so you stick the rhinestone and press a little bit just to make it adhere better I have a video which, which is called applying rhinestones where I speak in more detail and show how to apply rhinestones you might want to check this out as well I'm gonna uh, put the link to it to the sidebar so don't forget to check it out right so now when everything is completely completely dry uh, you wanna apply the top coat this will help the rhinestones um, stick better and um, the designed to be more long-lasting, the colors to be more bright and vivid. This is a very very important step, so you should never never ever leave it out. Yeah, and because we have so many rhinestones on our nails, we need a good 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 amount of the top coat. See, you wanna make a little flood of the top coat product for your rhinestones here and after you apply the top coat after this last last step you should also be patient to let everything dry because um, it's gonna be drying like about 20 minutes because you have so much going on on your nails but 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 if you have if you don't have uh, much time to uh, dry your nails I recommend uh, to use uh, MAC top coat it's called uh, over lacquer I guess it's only 11 or 12 dollars but it is a really really good product it dries really really fast I mean in I don't know in less than half of a minute in less than 30 seconds your nails are absolutely dry I mean you can scratch your nails and uh, your design will stay in place okay so I hope you like this uh, design and um, yeah I am always always looking for your feedback and your comments and your messages so don't hesitate to leave them for me and yeah take care I will see you soon bye bye